gentlemen, the Jeff Matika Show, featuring Jeff Matika. You may recognize tonight's guest as the star of Season 4, Episode 1 of the Showtime hit series Nurse Jackie, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Billy Joe Armstrong. <laughs> So, uh, let's start light. How's sobriety treating you? <laughs> Sobriety's going well. It's going well. Uh, have my, <laughs> I have my, I have my ups and downs, uh, but uh, overall, um, I'm either high or I'm low. What's the first thing you do after a show? The first thing I do after a show. I drink a lot of water, I take a shower because I'm filled with sweat. Yeah, I just try to decompress because it's two and a half hours of nonstop energy. You know, and it's probably a treat to uh, watch the rest of us change. So. Yes, it is, you know, it's nothing like uh, six naked men in one room that, what, what's, what's there not to enjoy? Do you have names for your guitars? I do have some names for guitars. I have uh, my main one, well, not my main one, but the one I've had since I was 12, and I call it blue because it's the color blue. Hmm. Creative, right? Very interesting. Mm. <laughs> and then there's, uh, I think, uh, one that I, I call Smash, which is my uh, TV yellow Les Paul Jr. And then, oh, I play the Rickenbacker and I call it Rick James. Oh, baby, yeah! Thank you, White Wolf. You got it. <laughs> How does it feel to play Dookie in its entirety for the first time in many years? It was cool. We did it, uh, we, we played Dookie in Serbia. And I think we just wanted to uh, take a left turn left turn from uh, the regular set. Some of the songs we haven't played since we recorded them in 1994. So, uh, yeah, playing Having a Blast is, was a blast. Interesting. <laughs> Who were your biggest inspirations growing up? I would say Domino's Pizza, Ricky Henderson, Eddie Van Halen, Motley Crue, Operation Ivy, in no particular order. But Motley Crue is probably closer to the top. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for your, yeah, for your sake, yes. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Would you rather have a rabbit-sized elephant or an elephant-sized rabbit? I would rather have a jackalope-sized uh, liger. Mm. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> <laughs> You've mentioned that you like the replacements. Mm -hmm. Do you have a favorite replacement song or album? Is that on there? It is. Oh wow! My fa uh, favorite replacement song or um, there's one song called that's been stuck in my head lately. That's only go by. It's not really a favorite or not. But the latest one to be stuck in my head is uh, "Nowhere Is My Home." Um, which I think was an outtake off of Tim. And I think right now I'd say Tim is one of my favorites. Do you have a favorite TV series? My favorite TV series is either Game of Thrones, um, Boardwalk Empire, or um, Eastbound and Down. You're a fan of HBO. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. What's the last album you listened to? The last album I listened to was um, End of the Century by the Ramones. <laughs> How many pets do you have? I've got three pets. I've got uh, three dogs. And <laughs> Mickey, Rocky, and Cleo.
I don't have any birds though. You have any birds there, White Wolf? That's what I do with my birds. <laughs> Shoot. <laughs> Look at this guy right here. Yeah, watch it. You don't even blink, do you? Staring contest, you and me, right now. You win. You always do. Something white. How sobriety. No, it's not funny. I hope you're not on my bus anymore. I didn't understand a word you said. I, I said I hope you're not on my bus anymore. <laughs> All right then. See you later. <laughs>